Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the electric Israeli, and thank you for joining my channel. If you are new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all of those who are my patrons and those who use my Tesla referral code to buy your Tesla. And until the end of September of 2019, we, you now can get 2,000 free uh, supercharging uh, miles. Uh, it's a two weeks program, so if you are interested in buying Tesla, Hopefully you can use uh, my referral code and another update on the never-ending story of the Tesla truck and the Tesla truck uh, reveal which was imminent uh, now is going to be pushed to November Elon Musk uh, just answered uh, Vincent's tweet uh, asking this question he said it looks like it is a, a November reveal that doesn't mean production as you know and production that is clearly for sure after the beginning of the production of the Model Y, which is supposed to be uh, middle to end of 2020. So you're talking about a uh, production of 2021. Now, why is that important? First of all, it's important that Tesla uh, revealed this is the most important segment in American uh, car ownership, the, the, the trucks, the pickup trucks and the SUVs and the light SUVs and the CUVs, all that segment is the most popular cars. Uh, why is it important the uh, production date? Because Tesla is not alone. As you know, Rivian has introduced their amazing, amazing uh, truck and SUV last year in Los Angeles. I did see it in New York Auto Show <coughs> last April. And they, the same thing, they're talking about 2020. So it might be that Rivian we will start production before Tesla. It's very, very possible. Ford, as in Ford F-150, had that same, fa I mean, that famous video of the Ford F-150 electric uh, pulling a million pounds of, uh, uh, of uh, uh, you know, a rail track. Uh, there is no mention or talk about um, production dates. So we don't know. We know that they are um, planning to do that. And of course, um, uh, Atlas also uh, working on it. So they're not the only ones, they're not the only ones, uh, Burlington also, they're not the only ones who are doing that, but I think the closest one, in my opinion, to actually start some production is gonna be Rivian. And then we'll see what Ford will do, we'll see what Tesla will actually get it going. But I don't feel that this is gonna be a race, meaning whoever go first, is going to win all the marbles? I don't think so. Uh, I remember the um, Chevy Bolt EV uh, was uh, produced a year ahead of Tesla, and of course, they have Tesla Model 3, and we know that Tesla Model 3 is dominating in the United States. So I don't think that if if um, if um, Rivian going to start, they're going to get uh, and Tesla going to come after. That means Tesla is going to lose that. Ford F-150 may get a leg up if they start because Ford F-150 is the most sold truck in the United States. It's a very, very popular car. So they might, uh, will do that. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. So we now know, we now know <laughs> that uh, Tesla truck, uh, Cyberpunk, uh, 50,000 or less, starting price four to 500 miles range, uh, crazy speed and crazy towing capacity is going to be revealed in uh, November, and that's going to be amazing, amazing. I cannot wait. It's the most exciting thing ever. Thank you guys for watching. Give me a thumbs up. See you tomorrow.